Eastern PA Weather Authority Meteorologist Bobby Marchers here with your outlook for November 1st, 2016. Started off with Thursday morning's image here because I want to purposely do that. I want to show you this area of high pressure that's off to uh, off in northern New England. This has been a control of our weather for the last two days and it brought us uh, brought us cooler weather yesterday. It's going to do so again today, but it's slowly going to move out to sea in this direction like this. So that's going to allow for warm air uh, to come in around this high. Wait, it's all this warm air is sitting out here waiting to come in eastward. And I think that's going to come in here for a couple of days anyway through the middle of the week. Going a little bit further here, we're going to show the high pressure off to the east now. Uh, we might have a, in the overnight period, might have a few extra clouds because of this. Some mostly cloudy skies. We're going to have just because you have winds coming in from the south here, uh, kind of like a warm front on the leading edge of that uh, warmer air coming in overnight. So it won't be as cool tonight as it was on pre uh, the previous night. And as this high pressure moves away, we have uh, warm, a warming trend that's going to be taking place as that sets up shop south of the region. And the winds start coming in from the southwest. It's coming in here on Wednesday and Thursday. So you have temperatures in the 65 to 70 degree range, maybe lower 70s here in Philadelphia, in the Philadelphia metro and points south and east. Uh, that'll be for highs on Wednesday and maybe even warmer than that, mid-70s or uh, or so in, uh, for, in those same areas that are in the lower 70s on, uh, on Wednesday uh, for Thursday. So the rest of us will be generally upper 60s near 70 and a very warm day for both days. But uh, I do think this is a transient warmth spell here. We are going to have a cold front that's going to be approaching the area here on Thursday. Here's a look at Thursday morning. Still dry. The day will start off uh, partly cloudy for the for at least for our eastern sections and then clouds will increase in the, and we're expecting this rain to come through generally in the afternoon hours and uh, here's a look at around noon or so here on on Thursday. Clearly you can see uh, area low pressure is sitting right here. Uh, your cold front sitting back here like this and this is coming through all along that cold front and uh, that will come through during the day on sub uh, on uh, Thursday, mainly in the afternoon and early evening hours before it uh, moves off the coast. This is looking at late evening, very far eastern areas, just getting in the, the last remnants of those showers. Might be a little bit breezy as the front comes through, but other than that, uh, we go back to uh, mostly sunny skies here on Friday. High pressure is going to be sitting right in this position just to our west over the weekend here from Friday through Sunday. Northwest winds coming in around that high, so we're going to be back to cooler temperatures. Nothing too crazy cool, though. I don't think we're going to be... Uh, really cold yet. I still think the second half of this month is when we really start getting into the colder uh, colder air. We're just going to be seasonably cool, maybe slightly below normal for a couple of days uh, as we head through the weekend, but it should be at least a dry weekend, uh, not showing any precipitation whatsoever. Here's uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I just, I just snapshot it through all three days, and you can see the high pressure still sitting out here, just funneling in those northeast or northwest winds and keeping it cool but dry over the weekend under mostly sunny skies. I'm Easter PA Weather Authority meteorologist Bobby Markrich. That is your outlook for November 1st, 2016. Have a great Tuesday.